Incidentally, it's not for nothing that Bangalore is called India's IT capital. Now there's government provided free Wi Fi in a host of locations, a first of this kind for any metro. Pull over at Brigade Road, do the impossible. Simply log on to an app which shows the nearest parking slot, go on and shop. Want to dispose garbage? Look up the net again. Check this other cool app which shows the nearest garbage throwaway point. All of this part of Bangalore's free Wi-Fi that is available in five different locations. The IT department of the state government along with a private firm hopes to provide bandwidth in almost all parts of the tech city. I have tried the Wi-Fi and it's really fast. Suppose quickly find a food joint at a place like MG Road. Wi-Fi would help me with that. A person can log on to free Wi-Fi for up to three hours a day, can download up to 50 MB of data and at one time about 2,000 users can be allowed from one location. So I think it's good to have that because it makes you very empowered. I think a very empowering tool. I wish every young person in this country will have connected to the net. That's our dream. We will at our server log in the IP address, log in the sites he goes to, what he browses, how much he downloads, every single thing will be available. So it's completely secure. The youngest city as it may be, Bangalore is also called the startup city, a place, a hub rather for entrepreneurs. And it seems that youngsters are viewing this particular initiative as an opportunity, a platform where all these cool apps that they create can find some space and people can have free access to. Radhika Ayur in Bangalore, NDTV.